Red Sox update. Saturday, June 1st, 2013, the Red Sox stopped the Yankees at Yankee Stadium with a barrage of hits after a tough 4-1 loss to the Yankees last night at Yankee Stadium and the Red Sox and Yankees screw up in game number two of the three game weekend series at the Bronx. And in the top of the third inning, the Boston Red Sox got off to an explosive start in the top of the third inning as Mike Carp doubles on a fly ball to left field of Vernon Wells. And Jackie Bradley Jr. scores and then it was to third and it was 1-0 in favor of the Red Sox. And a big grand salami or grand slam came in the top of the third inning on a Mike Napoli hits a grand slam to right center field. And Dylan Navas scores, Mike Carp scores, David T scores and Mike Napoli scores. And it was fine enough in Red Sox to do three innings. And in the bottom of the fourth inning, the New York Yankees get their only run of the game. In the bottom of the fourth inning, on a Chris Stewart out on a sacrifice fly to center fielder Jackie Bradley Jr. And Jason Nick scores was 5-1 in favor of Red Sox for four innings. But the Yankees only run is in the bottom fourth inning. Because in the top of the eighth inning, the Red Sox got three runs in it. Eight inning on a Dan and Navo homer in the top of the eighth inning on a fly ball to right center field. And Jose Iglesias scores. Jackie Bradley Jr. scores and Dan and Navo scores. And it was eight to one in favor of Red Sox in the top of the eighth inning and through eight innings. And in the top of the ninth inning, the Red Sox added three more runs to their repertoire as in the top of the ninth inning. Steven drew homers on a fly ball to right field as fourth for the season, and it was 9-1 in favor of the Red Sox. And Jose Iglesias singles on a soft line drive to left fielder Vernon Wells, and Jared Saltmeyer scores, and it was 10-1 to the Red Sox. And the Red Sox wrapped up their scoring parade on a Dan Nava ground out. Shorts up Jason Nix to first baseman Mark Tischer, and Jose Iglesias scores. Here's the Boston Red Sox. Bounce back big time from their tough 4-1 loss to the Yankees last night as they blow out the New York Yankees at Yankee Stadium 11-1 as Felix Dubrock got the win to go to 4-2 in the season with 16 pitch, 6 hits, 1 run, 1 earned run, and 3 battle balls and 6 strikeouts. Losing pitcher Phil Hughes who drops to 2-4, Felix Dubrock goes to 4-2 in the season. Tomorrow night will be the final game of the three game weekend series at Yankee Stadium. Tomorrow night at Yankee Stadium as Clay Buckles on the mound for the Red Sox. Wow! For the Yankees, we'll have Hiroki Kuroda on the mound for the Yanks. Okay, other scores around the major leagues in the top of the fourth inning was the Chicago Cubs 3, the Arizona Diamondbacks 1. In the bottom of the second inning was the Los Angeles Angels nothing, the Houston Astros nothing. In the bottom of the second inning was Toronto 1, San Diego 1. In our final scores, it was Cleveland Blank in Tampa Bay, 5 to nothing. It was Minnesota edging at Seattle, 5 to 4. It was St. Louis Blank in San Francisco, 8 to nothing. In the first game, in the second game, was St. Louis 7, San Francisco 1 in the second game. It was Oakland and Jack, Chicago White Sox in 10 innings, 4 to 3. It was Detroit beating Baltimore by a touchdown, 10 to 3. It was Kansas City 4, Texas 1, final in 10 innings. Milwaukee, edge out Philadelphia 4 to 3. It was Colorado, edge out Los Angeles Dodgers 10 innings, 7 to 6. It was Miami, Marlins 8, New York Mets 1, and the Cincinnati Blanky Pittsburgh 2 to nothing. And it was Atlanta 2, Washington 1, and final in 10 innings. How about them, Red Sox?